The world is rapidly transitioning to low-carbon technologies such as wind turbines, solar panels, and battery storage to combat climate change. But these technologies require large amounts of metals and minerals that must be mined. One 3-megawatt wind turbine needs 4.7 tons of copper alone. Solar PV cells also need many critical minerals and even precious metals such as silver. All this renewable energy needs to be stored somewhere, and lithium-ion batteries, which are used in electric vehicles and home battery packs, also need many minerals. Renewable energy technologies require enormous amounts of different minerals, from nickel to cobalt. By 2050, this demand will skyrocket. Sustainable and reliable production must keep up. This leaves the world with a problem to solve, but also an opportunity. With over 3 billion people living in resource-rich countries, there is a real opportunity for the poorest and most vulnerable to benefit from the energy transition. In places like the Democratic Republic of Congo, India, and Peru, new jobs will be created, infrastructure built, and government revenues boosted. But significant challenges will emerge if this transition is not managed responsibly and sustainably. While mining is crucial to build green technologies, it can have significant environmental and social impacts. For example, it accounts for up to 11% of global energy use. To truly benefit from the increase in mineral demand, developing countries must make mining as sustainable and green as possible. These countries will need good governance, knowledge, capacity, and strategy. They will need climate-smart mining. This new World Bank initiative supports the responsible extraction and processing of minerals and metals while minimizing carbon and material footprints. The World Bank and its partners are implementing climate smart mining to ensure minerals are mined in a sustainable way that benefits people and the planet. From extraction to end use, every step of the process must take a holistic approach and incorporate four key themes climate mitigation, climate adaptation, reducing material impacts, creating market opportunities. Everyone, from governments and mining companies to the end users of renewable technologies, must work together to ensure low carbon technologies are built in a sustainable way. Only then can we build a low carbon future. To learn more, visit worldbank.org.